Hello everyone, how are you all doing? In this video, we are going to talk about iOS 17 Beta 2. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, I know you guys are excited and so am I. So without wasting any more time, let's dive into this video and talk about iOS 17 Beta 2. Let's get right into this video and make sure to hit that subscribe button so that you don't miss any of my future videos like these. I know you guys love these and I love to make these as well. So please hit that subscribe button. We are so close to 10k and I want to get to 10k as soon as we can. Now that you are subscribed, let's get right into this video. So I'm posting this video on the 19th of June and this means that we are officially two weeks ahead of apple beta 1 when apple released the beta 1 of ios 17 it's been exactly two days today is monday the time i'm posting this video and apple has released the ios 17 beta 1 for two weeks it's been two weeks now and if history is an indication we will see the beta 2 as soon as today yes today may be the day when we will see the beta 2 of ios 17 today and if not today max to max tomorrow we will see the beta 2 of ios 17 now let's talk about what all new changes and feature which are gonna arrive on the beta beta 2 of ios 17 let's start up with new features number one thing which i really really wish apple to add is more customization on lock screen this is something that i really think that we will see in the beta 2 of ios 17 you already know we can now adjust the thickness of the time and all in the lock screen that is the new customization thing which is major on the ios 17 but what i think is apple will give us more options Options to customize our lock screen further for example they will give us more customization options in terms of the fonts of the lock screen then the next feature is related to standby what i expect apple to do with standby is to tweak standby and give us options to set the faces as we want right now the customization options are very limited in the standby option and if you want to look at your standby screen and you want it to be red all the time which looks really really dope you just can't do it because there is a particular angle which requires to see your screen when it is red and sometimes maybe it is a bug but most of the time it does not turn red for me i guess this is a bug but i wish apple should give us another face which should be red just like the apple watch ultra red mode what i you know what i'm talking about the font should be red which is easier on our eyes while looking in dark right now there are a lot of bugs on the ios 17 legit i have made a separate video on the bugs of ios 17 you can watch that video i have linked it in the description there will be a lot of bug fixes and i wish I wish Apple may add some new wallpapers as well. Yes, see, this is something which is really, really hit and miss. But uh, I really wish Apple to add no more new wallpapers because there aren't any new wallpapers on the iOS 17. I mean, pardon, okay, there are a lot of wallpapers, but you know what I mean. We just need a bit more. I have seen concepts of iOS 17 wallpapers which look really, really dope. I have talked to some of you guys on my Twitter and some of you guys also believe that we may see more new wallpapers on ios 17 beta 2 so let's hope and wish we will see some new wallpapers as well but i highly doubt that then the next bug is related to keyboard the keyboard is really really buggy the keyboard bug should be resolved as soon as possible because keyboard is something which is used really really often on our devices and i have noticed and i have talked to some of you guys as well and the keyboard of ios 17 is really really buggy indeed some of you guys were like uh, one guy was andrew and the other one was apple pixel pro on twitter so i talked to these guys and they are having really really bad bugs on their keyboard as well including me i'm also having a lot of resprings and whenever i try to open keyboard settings and change something in the keyboard it just doesn't change for some reason i have to restart my device and then the settings change of the keyboard for example if i want to change the auto correction 
punctuation or smart punctuation if i tweak anything in the keyboard it just doesn't work i expect apple to make this ios 17 beta to more related to the bug fixes because there are a lot of bugs which should be resolved first and then the features should be added but of course betas history if history is an indication we have seen apple doing both simultaneously let's hope for the best and today fingers crossed hope so we will see the ios 17 beta 2 if not today max to max by tomorrow we will see the ios 17 beta 2 fingers crossed let's hope for the best and uh, let me know down in comments below what all issues you are facing on your device on ios 17 and i will also talk about more things which are faced by you guys in my next video let me know down in comments below i will feature you in my next video and i will catch you guys in the very next episode if you did watch this video till the end and liked watching this video make sure to hit that subscribe button because we are so close to 10k and i want to get to 10k as soon as you can this is me jay aka tech hyped signing off